Delicious. Delicious. What is what is happening? What is what is all right? They, cook, serve, delicious. They, they 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 just keep singing the name of the game delicious. just over and over again. I don't I don't know what's happening. I don't know what's happening. All right, this is one of those like order filling games, I believe, where you get orders and you're supposed to fill fill them really quickly. Kind of like Overcooked a little bit, except that was like the whole point of that is to be like a co-op thing where you're off-handing tasks and you're, you know, working together. This is a single-player game where I think you just have to be efficient or something. Never played the first one. Got a code. Let's give it a go. Uh, sure, look, saves. Sure. Ah, uh, I'm free from that overpowering intro song. It began like any other morning at Sherry Soda Tower. You rode the elevator up to your Platinum Star restaurant, cooked served delicious, and reflected warmly upon your culinary brilliance and managerial prowess. Life was good. Without warning, police surrounded Sherry Soda Tower. It seemed company executives were siphoning funds from the corporation while at the same time incurring a staggering amount of debt which drained the accounts of the tower and all the businesses inside. Everything was put up for federal auction. Cook served delicious was no more. I'm guessing that that was the final accomplishment you get at the end of the first game is, you're a platinum star restaurant, good job. Now we gotta make a sequel, so start over. Angry but determined to rebuild, you purchased a modest uh, commercial space on the 52nd floor of the Tarragon Tower the largest skyscraper in the city, packed with thousands of ravenous tenants. It is here that you will start a brand new Cook Serve Delicious restaurant. Build it back to its former glory, work in other restaurants to rebuild your finances, and expand your culinary knowledge, and cement your legacy as the first, as the best chef in the, chef in the world. Good luck. All right, let's just hop in, the basics. Welcome to Kirk, Cook Serve Delicious 2. This is a test kitchen where you can practice a bit. Wow. Wow. Things look spectacular in here, don't they? So unpainted walls, everyone in, in, in the here just looks sad and disheveled and has holes in all their clothes. Uh, you can practice here a bit. Uh, to your left are prep stations where orders appear as customers arrive. Enough talk, let's cook. Select the order by clicking the order on the left or by pressing one on your keyboard. All right, one. Hole in one nachos. To the right is your list of ingredients. Use the recipe on the bottom of the screen to place the correct ingredients ordered by the customer. All right. So you just type the large letter listed by the ingredient or click it to place it. Use the recipe below to see which ingredients you need. So I need case I need a queso, sour cream, and, and beans. No jalapenos. So you'd want to do you'd want to get all the the hotkeys down, huh? QSG. Those are all over the goddamn keyboard, huh? I feel like I just mess up. Uh, use the re this recipe to place the right ingredients for the order. When finished, press Enter or click the recipe to serve. I'm probably gonna be playing this episode with the mouse and losing tons of time as a result compared to how fast you probably should be going when you're really good at this game. We'll see. All right, so. Boom. What do you want? Meat patty. Boom, boom, boom. What? The meat is cooking. The white timer indicates how long this food has left to cook. Once it turns blue, the food is ready to be prepped again. Select the order once it turns blue. Don't prep too early or the order will be raw. Oh, do I do it now? Uh, okay, I think, did it cook now? Did I do that? Okay, so, uh, where's the bacon? Bacon. Uh, lettuce. Swiss cheese. Fried egg pretzel bun? What? There's another, oh, there's another page. Fried egg pretzel bun. Boom, look at that. Alright. Uh, so spacebar changes pages. Are we good to go then? Did I do it? Did I do good? 
Depending on how accurate your ingredient placement... Oh, was that neutral? Your, depending on how accurate your ingredient placement was, and if the food was fully cooked, you receive a perfect average or bad rating. Always strive for a perfect rating. It will bring more customers, income, and bonuses at the end of the day. An average rating doesn't hurt or help you, but a bad rating will decrease customers. So did I do something out of order? Ah! At the top of the screen, you'll find the holding stations. Holding stations are the key to making things much easier for you when you have a huge amount of customers walking through the door. In fact, if you don't utilize them, the game can become quite difficult and sometimes impossible. Try accepting the order on the left. You'll notice that you cannot select this food. It has a red HS icon, meaning that it is being prepared at a holding. St it must be prepared at a holding station before you can serve it. Uh, let's do that now. Select the holding station one by clicking it or ta or pressing the bu the button combination. So tab plus one. Oh man. So when you in order to be a high end player at this game, you probably have to have like insane control over hotkeys. You probably don't use the mouse at all. You probably have both hands on the keyboard, and you were just nailing it. Uh, yeah, it's just that's all it said. Okay, so you click this, then tab one. Select the pretzel and follow the recipe. The recipe will completed completely random each time you make a food in the holding station. So play, pay close attention to the to make sure it's done perfectly. Okay, so select a food to prep. Each page is different ca uh, category of food. Holding station requires foods. Holding station, optional foods, and side dishes. How do I make the pretzel itself? A German pretzel. Is it cooking? So, oh, enter as cook, okay. Pretzels are now cooking. Just like the hamburger, we must wait until the food is finished before cooking and selecting it again. Holding stations are fully automated. Once it's finished cooking, it will automatically be ready to serve. Like that. Boom, okay. Hmm. The descriptions sound really complicated, but then you realize that, like, what's actually happening is really simple. But I, I don't know if they could make the instructions that much simpler without actually being untrue. Order completed. Once serving has been deducted from the holding station, you still have three more left to serve to anyone coming in wanting pretzels. Oh, so I have- so I used up one, but I have three more pretzels left. Food will decrease in freshness as the day progress. Once the clock runs out next to the serving number, the food must be thrown away. Certain foods stay fresher longer than others. At holding stations must be cooked perfectly, they cannot be served. Try serving these next three orders. So I just I just hand off the things we'd already made. See how fast you can serve customers with holding stations? They're great! You've learned the very basics of the game. However, there are still items such as side dishes, chores, drinks, and holding station optional foods that can uh, you can learn in the extra tutorials. You should also uh, you should absolutely check out those when you can. If you are ready to cook, hop onto the into Max Wieners. <laughs> I heard they're looking for a good chef, or spend your money over at the cooking uh, food catalog and start building your own menu in Cook Serve Delicious. Good luck. Chef Risotto. Your name is food. I know how to make a risotto. Oh. Let's just hop right in. This is apparently less than a minute. Holding station operation uh, optional foods are orders that can be either either be prepped in a prep station or made ahead of time in a holding station. Start by selecting the order on the left and to prep it. So we dunk and cook after prepping the ingredients, which we do just by clicking nuggets, I suppose? Then you hit enter? Or do I click on you manually? Oh, dunk is the other button. Dumb. Didn't even somehow just miss that altogether. A plus on my part. Alright, so the food is now cooking. Be served when finished. Serve, uh, serve the order once it's ready. Right... Now. Oh yeah, look at that. Easy enough, but we can get ahead of uh, we can get get ahead by making this food beforehand. Select holding station one, then turn the page to the holding station optional foods, and select pick, uh, chicken nuggets. Boom! Nugget, 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 dunk. Hook. Now I'm gonna have so many nuggets. All right. Oh shit, how did I know that this was gonna ha- oh, I just destroyed that. I just deleted it, didn't I? S son of a bitch. 
Uh, tap plus one. No. You have several chicken nugget orders that ready in advance. You should totally hand those in. Nope, because I did the clicky wrong. I clicked on the thing instead of those and it threw it away. I screwed up the tutorial. Tutorials are too hard for me, apparently. And now I can't make more than one nugget because I can't get to the holding station because I can't figure out how to leave the screen because it like locked me in here. So I'm really just messing everything up. It's fine. It's just, it's fine. I'm just, I'm a disaster. There we go. Now the holding station's actually happening. Wow, I messed that up. I messed up the tutorial. <laughs> This is like the opposite of a let's playable game because of how much crap you'd have to process and like the, the ideal play is probably you sitting here in complete silence and just like zenning out and just nailing it just nailing it just multitask craziness it seems neat though as you can see you can serve a lot more orders faster this way but beware hs optional foods take up space that might be better used for side dishes or more holding station required foods it'll be up <clears throat> up to you to find the perfect balance with each menu good luck Side dishes. Customers won't wait for their orders for very long. As you can see, this uh, order that has arrived is quickly going off the screen. If it disappears completely... Oh, it is disappearing off the screen, yeah. Is it going to go away before I finish reading this? It'll be counted as a bad order, for, order if it disappears. Oh no. Is it going away? Goodbye, that guy. Alright, I lose. <laughs> You can see how long your customer will wait by the patience meter, measured in seconds. This meter will drain as you make more and more perfect foods and your buzz increases. To increase customer's patience, you must make side dishes, select holding station one, turn the page to side dishes and prepare the side salad. What? Okay. So, are you, yep, side salad. Uh, lettuce, carrots, carrots is A. Tomatoes, croutons, cucumbers. Enter. Boom. Every unique side dish in your holding station adds 15 seconds to the patience meter. Then you can have up to three unique sides on your menu, uh, which can give you a possible 45 extra seconds of patience. This is huge when you have a large influx of customers. They will always be or or order a random available side dish with their meal, which also increases your income. You should, uh, you should try to always be have at least one side dish near your holding stations. It's an easy way to prevent walkouts and bad orders. Okay. Drinks and delicious. This, this is a really extensive tutorial, isn't it? Drinks like side dishes allow you to add extra income. Add income to every entree that goes out the door. Each drink item has a set number of customers it can serve before it has to be refilled. When a customer orders a drink and a side dish, their entree order is done perfectly. You will earn a delicious rating. This gives you tips and your yum a big boost. <laughs> so always try to strive for this rating. This game has a lot going on. You know you're in trouble when it opens with like a half an hour manual that you have to get through to start the game. But it's probably, it's probably fun as hell to actually go into and just get sucked into. Every entree has its own set of unique boosters and detractors, most of which deal with the game's chores. Some foods are overly trashy, resulting in larger amounts of trashy chores per day, while others are relatively clean, making room for that many more food orders. By failing to do a chore, you will earn a sick rating, which decreases your buzz by a much larger margin than a bad order would. Because I'm guessing we're talking about somebody being actually sick and not like Tony Hawk sick buzz. Each time you pull off a perfect or delicious order, your buzz increases. Buzz determines how many customers per hour you receive in a day. Buzz can fluctuate throughout the shift for many reasons, so be sure to read up on foods before you purchase them. Your restaurant's buzz is not affected by your performance in other restaurants. Chef for hire. Cool moves. Keyboard users can fully remap their keys for holding stations, prep stations, and even go with a universal key option for ingredients. Be sure to check it out in the options keyboard menu. A universal key option for ingredients. Does that mean it's universal, like, based on what order they're in on the menu? That'd probably be nice. Gamepad users, try holding down a shoulder button when pressing the up and, uh, the, the D-pads and whatnot. You can skip uh, to every other prep station, allowing you to move quicker. You can also flick the right thumbstick up and down to immediately skip to the beginning and end of your prep stations. 
All right, there's a lot going on there. Mouse users, try using the scroll wheel to move the ingredients page and right click anywhere on the screen to cook or serve a dish. You can change these behaviors in, in the menus. There's, there's a lot of control. Okay, so instead of hitting, try, trying to hunt for like enter and stuff like that, I can just hit right click. That's good to know. They have three separate control schemes because they know how, all right, yeah. It's, that, that's nice that they have that much attention to detail. Let's try practice chores. Okay. Oh, man. Okay, so let's try the, to do the toilet. The restaurant needs attention. Okay. Flush. Sanitize. Boom. All right. Worn tick, uh, work ticket dishes. Load the dishes. Okay, yeah, load the dishes. Begin to wash. Release, unload, sanitize. Always sanitize or you're a bad cook. Oh my God, everything's on fire. This really should have come first, honestly. I feel like I should have started with that one. All right, well. Oh, there's a rat. Lock, cheese, sanitize. All right. There wasn't a rat yet. There just might be a rat. Uh, I'm letting out the... Ew. All right. That's pretty gross. Insect traps. Set trap, sanitize. Toilet again, flush sanitize. Uh, okay, somebody's, wait, wait a minute. The robbers, somebody's robbing me, so I need to beat them up. Oh, take that, you thought you could take this place from me? I, wor I worked uh, out my ass off, apparently. What the fuck? I were just, <laughs> just stomp the trash into the garbage, because there's too much trash. <laughs> oh no, stop doing that. <laughs> okay, this game's amazing. This game is the dumbest, most amazing thing. Oh my goodness, the chores are such a fantastic idea. <laughs> I like how that you can just get to the you can get the robber whenever you feel like. Like you really don't have to get it. You don't really have to get right to it. He straight up makes like a, I just got take, I, he, he makes a, I got knocked out in Street Fighter sound with the echo and everything. I don't think this is going to stop. I think I'm just going to be stuck here until I get bored and leave. I don't think this is like a, there's an end game. Let's uh, escape. There we go. All right. So that was, that was practice. Well, okay. What's the intro? Uh, that's just what happened in the story. Okay. Well then, how about we start? doing a mission, I guess? Emails. Welcome to Tarragon Tower. Dear Chef, on behalf of Tarragon Management, I'd like to welcome you to our tower. I was sad to read that Sherry Soda's management solicited activities led you to led to your previous business going under, but I am nonetheless thrilled to have you here with us. From one business owner to another, let me tell you that starting over isn't the end of the world. I've had my fair share of towers crumble to the ground, sometimes literally, but that has never stopped me from starting over and reaching for even greater success. Lindsay Baker. Heart, I guess. What does these buttons mean? That's just me harding it for later. Let's unhard it. I'm not going to ever need that. Tower? Welcome to- oh, that's, the, that's where they hit the campaign. Okay. This is an all-new campaign where you can run your own cook, serve, delicious restaurant to work in other restaurants across the tower. Nail perfect orders. Complete bonus objectives within K CSD or earn cash metal- uh, earn me I, I heard just thought CSD was it as cash for some reason, so I just said cash medals for no reason. In, a, in other restaurants, to earn yum points. Yum, gain enough yum points and you level up. Each, every fifth rank earns you a half star. Get a full five star restaurant to be the best shop at the tower. Oh, and be sure to try the tutorials. <laughs> Let's just play a game. I just I, just, I need to play a level. <laughs> I need to experience what a level is. Let's just start it. I'm going to like a, 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 a it's, it's a hot dog shack. How hard could it be? It's Max Wieners. Complete a day with fewer than eight bad orders, fewer than five average orders, no average or bad orders. So it's like three tiers of how good you are, I guess. Sure. I got this. Let's make corn dogs. Oh yeah. Pretzels. Oh, did I make that one bad? Oh, that guy wants 
That guy wants a hot dog. Okay, well, I'm making a hot dog already, so good news. No, no, don't throw it away. Stop throwing it away. Ketchup. They want ketchup. Get it out of here. Uh, that guy wants pretzels. Which type of pretzels? They want that? Yeah, you got- Okay, we already, we already had the pretzels. We're good. Everything's good. Did I make a- Did I make that one wrong? Pretzel classic. Cook. Hot dogs. I keep clicking on the hot dog because I keep thinking I should click on the thing that is the thing that I'm actually wanting. Toilet. Yeah. I clean that toilet so fast that it's like I didn't even clean it at all. <laughs> Uh, what the fuck is that? Everything's fine. No, it's fine. Uh, no, I don't want this. No, I don't want that either. How do I leave? No. Uh, one. How do I go to one? You, this thing isn't here. Hot dog. Oh, does that how I do it? Wieners. I don't know how to- Okay, I'm a little, a little confused now. Okay, I'm making hot dogs, I guess. Uh, that guy is good. That guy's- You want ketchup? Good. Boom. Wait, did I do that wrong? I'm sorry. Wieners, okay. You're cooking a wiener. Uh, what? I don't know how to make this. Okay, there we go. Got- okay, I guess I did a bad job. I should pay more attention or something. Oh, no, we don't want trash. Get out of here, trash. Uh, oh no, not the toilet. Apparently the toilet can become too bad. <laughs> that, that's, that's bad. Don't become too bad. Uh, the, the regular... No, I didn't mean to do that. Shit, I hit enter, and that's the wrong thing to press. Rush hour? Oh, I'm dead. This is how I die. This is the end of me. Uh, no. No. How do I undo a thing that I click on an accident? Shit. No, how do I make- what is that? Can't I- can't I make a side thing where I make a ton of those? Oh, fuck it. Shit. That person's gonna be mad. <laughs> I did a bad job. Uh, queso, sour cream, beans. Oh yeah. Uh, queso, sour cream, beans. Boom, 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 boom. There we go. Alright, uh, ketchup. Oh, it says mustard. The picture's lying to you. It says ketchup in the picture, but it's not actually- doesn't mean it. You, I need to make a drink? Oh, I need to fix the drinks. Okay, cool. There you go, buddy. Uh, queso, sour cream, beans. Boom. Uh, do do Boom, boom. do 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 You want ketchup? Yeah! The picture lies to you is what I learned. Don't trust the picture. You wanted a premium bun, I did a bad job. Uh, premium. Uh, cheese. Relish. Chili. Onions. Mustard. Ketchup. Boom. Uh, stop being a fucked up toilet. I need- got shit to do. Boom. Uh, do. Alright, uh, you can catch up. We're good. Did I do it wrong? Oh, I said mustard didn't. I'm, I'm a stupid, stupid man. Alright, fuck it. I'm gonna make a billion horn dogs. I'm gonna make so many corn dogs. I said, I said horn dogs. I meant to say corn dogs. Those are different words. German style pretzels. Uh, shit. No, I didn't mean to. Okay, uh, get out of here. My brain's gonna melt. <laughs> Hi, um, you want ketchup? Doom. I did it correctly that time. Because I read what the words said instead of just clicking on something like a jackass, which is what I usually do, apparently, because I'm deficient. Shit. How do you undo something and not give it to them? Fuck it. There you go. I don't- I don't know how to undo- <laughs> Alright. Get out of here. Oh yeah. That's how good I am. Get in there. Gross. I tried to think about that one in particular. I hate that. Opening up, like, lights or something that are full of, like, dead insects. I'm like, ugh. Oh, apparently that one's too bad now. It's fine, I'll just keep making more. Apparently we don't have to worry about overhead when I, like, don't... There doesn't seem to be consequences when I, like, don't actually sell what I make. Uh, maybe there is, though? I don't know. Get out of here. Get out of here, only customer. Yeah? Right, everything's just dying now, basically. Oh my goodness. Wieners. Wieners! Alright. Uh, uh, do, do, do. Uh, do, do, do. Uh, I need more of the things. Uh, okay, so jalapenos, beans. But do. Why am I the only chef in this whole building? Did, oh, this one almost break or something? Uh, pretzel bun. Mm, onions, mustard, ketchup, boom. Alright. Uh, premium. Cheese. Premium cheese. Premium onions, mustard, ketchup. Boom! I am a god, a shiny god. 
uh, premium. That's all. That's all they wanted. <laughs> premium. Premium. It really throws me for a loop when they literally don't want even like a ketchup. But they just want the thing. That's it. That's the only thing they wanted. Like, what's wrong with them? What? You don't want anything on it? Okay. Sure. Ketchup. Boom. That, okay. Just dry. You fucking lunatic. Uh. Oh no. I'm out of. Pre I'm out of things. Corn dogs. I don't need corn dogs. Actually, I kind of need corn dogs. The other one's gonna break soon. Oh, there's a rat problem. We gotta get mm, die. Uh, premium. I did. I didn't mean to hit enter. I'm so sorry. This is not how the real life works. <laughs> you can't make mistakes that easily. Not that instant. Not that instantly. Boom. Oh yeah. Okay. So uh, space bar is the correct thing to press. There we go. There we go. I am doing it. Boom. Get out of here. Look at that. Look at that meter. Look at what that thing I'm doing. I'm not even saying words. I'm just... I, th I think I am saying words, technically, but like another, none of this is a thought. I'm just... Oh, I didn't even read what you wanted. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm just bad at life. Didn't it say rush hour a second ago, but then the thing ended? I suck. <laughs> I, I served 53 people. I had a 14 combo. Uh... Failed, not a single delicious order, uh, which I already forgot kind of how to do, to be honest. Uh, six bad orders, six average orders. Shit. Shit. Alright, well, I got bronze. That's a. That's almost like being good at things. Oh, I, this. I can see this being a really good game. And it's like, un, it's like unless playable. Like, straight up unless playable. How do I get the other ones? How do, you, how do I lock these ones? What do I do with that? I'll go back here, I guess? What is this? Oh, I'm, I'm picking what I'll make. Salisbury steak. Ah, oh, yeah. And s cereal? Are you fucking serious? Alright, sure. <laughs> Mac and cheese. And the one drink. Oh, it's a soda fountain, so it's all the drinks, kind of. Start a new day. I was probably supposed to read about how to... What's good for my restaurant, but those are my only ingredients available, so fuck it. <laughs> I can see myself playing this game, I just can't see myself doing a series long term. Because, what am I even saying in this series? <laughs> Check it out for yourself, it's on the Steam, and also probably other places. Probably, I would assume. Prep any food to start the day. Pretzel. German. Boom. Macaroni. Ma'am. Why is that one always bad? Pretzel. German. Why does the game act like I did a bad thing whenever I make German? Salisbury steak. Boom. Butter steak. Get that shit going. Cereal. Uh... Choco chips. Choc crisps. And... Uh... Milk. Uh... And blueberries. Yeah, why am I s Is that a thing people do? They like, ask for- They go to like a place to serve milk- Uh, cereal? I've never experienced it before. Gravy. Did I do it wrong? I'm sorry. Butter steak. I can't even tell what I'm doing wrong half the time, to be honest. I, I'm just- I'm just a garbage person. Yeah, you guys look like you just woke up. Oh, yeah. Gross. Sorry I- your cereal was slightly delayed because I had to flush the toilet or something. Gross. Ah! Ah, juicy ooze. What the fuck? Okay, sure. Milk. Ah, uh, I'm so sorry. I can't. Uh, that one. You. Shit. Medium gravy was. The, I did it wrong. Damn it. I, it's just I, I. I reflexively sort of start pressing the right, the wrong thing, and it, then it's like it's too late. You already pressed it. You're doomed forever. You've already failed them. Everyone's disappointed in you. Your parents are disowning you. Flush that toilet. Uh, nobody wanted mac and cheese. I've just wasted all that mac and cheese. I'm gonna have to eat it myself after it's cold and sad. No! Oh no! No! Wheats! Uh, milk. Strawberries. Uh, you. You. Steak. Gravy. That's it. Uh, steak. Oh, gravy. I don't even know what that means. I just trust you. Uh, get out. How do I get out? Fuck it. No, how do I leave? How do I leave a menu when I get it into it on accident? Tab? Escape? Shit. I don't know how to leave. 
No, I, I guess I'm just giving him a gross, broken food. Damn it. This game has a lot of, like, you get trapped in a thing because you kind of hit a thing a little bit and you're like, and now you're doomed and you broke it forever. I'm like, no, don't take it out when it's not ready. That's not what I wanted you to do. Uh, butter. Uh, da -da. uh juicy O's. I'm melting. My brain is melting. My life is fire. Okay, uh, cornflakes. That one. And milk. Uh, shit, I need to make pretzels. Is that the... What kind of pretzels do you want? I assume it's this one. I don't know. How do you tell? There's two types of pretzels, and I'm always confused by that, because it seems like there's only ever been one that people want. Uh, gravy. Get out of here. Shit. Gravy. I didn't mean to do- Shit. Nah, okay, sorry, you get- you get bad steak, because I accidentally clicked on you. Again. And apparently- <laughs> The idea that the chef accidentally took stuff out of the freeze- the fridge constantly is so crazy to think about. Boom. My brain is melting all the time. I don't know. Does anyone ever want that for real? Macaroni. Somebody order macaroni, please. Please, somebody order macaroni. I made it just for you. I never have to plunge the toilet so far. I just flush it a lot, which is really weird. <laughs> uh, medium gravy. All right. Boom. I'm doing things. Up. Oh, yeah, nobody wants that one. I must be doing something wrong with, with the German pretzel. Uh, oh, gravy. Ooh, that person's psyched about something. Uh, fiber blast milk. Oh, yeah, I like how psyched that person is about something. I don't really know. <laughs> I guess I'm, I must somehow be worthwhile sometimes at things. It's good to know that I'm not a complete failure. Boom, flushing toilets and serving pretzels. I, why do I- how off- do you- how much- how much toilet contact does the average food worker make every five minutes? Because I'm starting to wonder. Chop crisps, milk, strawberries. Do do boom. Do do boom. Doom doom. More pretzels, because apparently they go through. Uh, normal gravy. Uh, crisps. Milk, banana. Somebody likes bananas on their cereal, you goddamn lunatic. Uh, gravy. Sure. Oh man, all about them pretzels, all about them pretzels. Apparently. Ah, oh, goddammit, so many people, people want pretzels. Uh, oh, gravy. Uh, fiber milk. Fiber milk, fiber milk, fiber milk. Boom. Look at that. Get out of here, ruddy ass, broke shit. Boop, boop, boom. Uh, cornflakes and milk. Uh, nobody's, none of these steaks are ready. Alright, it's fine, it's fine, we're doing good. This is what doing good is like, right? Yeah, I'll just have to, uh, M gravy. Uh, M gravy. M gravy. Oh, thank you for being so homogenized as a group of people. Oh no, I'm sorry, I'm doing the wash and I can't leave that, apparently. Because of the sanitized thing. Boom. Look at me doing good. I don't think anybody has ever wanted a single macaroni the entire time I've been here. I'm just going to keep making it though. You can't stop me. Is there more things I can do with macaroni? There's not. I'm going to make more macaroni. You can't stop me. I'm, un I'm unbeatable. I'm unbreakable Kimmy Schmidt. Gross rats. I did it good? Did I do it good? Am I... Oh god, I have a 28 times perfect combo right now. Oh, I almost clicked on it. I almost clicked on it. I almost broke my combo. That would have ruined it. Oh, so that that means over. Okay. I saw that at the end last time, and I'm like, is it is it is it time for the is it for rush hour? <laughs> and then the game ended, and I'm like, I don't understand why it ended. I thought it was rush hour time. You're the last one, dude. You're the guy that makes us stay open. Steak. M gravy. Boom, 29 combo. Got deliciouses. Deliciouses is plural. I got 12 delicious orders, 3 average, 1 bad, 49 perfect. Um, that's a marked improvement, right? Anyway. 29 times combo. 
12 delicious orders. Item unlocked. Oh my god. Completed a day at KSD. I, I, okay, I'm just gonna hit enter a lot, honestly. <laughs> Due to this being mo most likely a let's try. Let's not process what the loot boxes are. And go to Edie's. That's a name of a store that somebody named on purpose. Is this like an Applebee's? This is like an Applebee's, isn't it? I really like this game, you guys. <laughs> I really like this game. It's just it's unfilmable, like Thumper. <laughs> where I don't think I can do a series on it. But I'm like, this is really cool. Go check out Thumper if you like music games. It's really not relevant at all to this. <laughs> Even a little bit. I don't know why I'm talking about it right now besides the part, my my specific experience. Uh, what do I do? Three fries and sh shoe fries? What the fuck? What are you talking about? Uh, how do I? Oh, dunk. I was like, enter isn't working, I'm scared. Uh, oh my god, Thousand Island. Jeez, I'm learning that the stuff is color-coded, so you can tell what, what, what when, the, when the color changes, that means you press spacebar to go to the next page. Because the ingredients being a different color means that it's time to go to the next page. Because, ah... Uh, croutons and mushrooms. Broccoli. Oh, I, I thought there was a thing on the bottom I went past on accident. That's, that's bad, I don't, I'm a bad. Parmesan, croutons, broccoli, cucumbers, there it is. Boom, flush that toe with it. What else can I make? Uh, macaroni. What do you want? You, ooh, uh, cheesecake, creme, key lime. I don't even know what the word was they were saying, to be honest. I'm just assuming. Oh, fuck you. Uh, applied breading. No? How did I fuck that up? Oh, you bread the thing afterwards. Okay. Mousse, mousse, cream. No, I didn't mean to do that, sorry. Don't, no, no, don't throw it away. I like the, I like it how it is. Carrots, tomatoes, croutons, cucumbers, boom. It's on, it's available. Get out of here. Oh, I, I'm sorry. I thought I did the thing. I guess I did do something wrong, but I didn't think I did something wrong, but I did do something wrong. Words. No, no, all the, all the, we're gonna lose all of our fries. One, two, three, four, five, six, bread. You have to re you have to literally read what it says. Uh, ranch. Uh, what the fuck? Egg bits, croutons, mushrooms, tomatoes. Now oh, I hit enter on accident instead of spacebar. Do one, two, three, four, five, six. Boom, boom. Oh, seasoning was that one. I did a st I did it bad, and I can't ever fix it ever, even though I know that I did it bad. And the real life, you'd probably fix it or something, instead of just being like, well, we're committed to being bad. Uh, do do. Thankfully, they do these in chronological order at the very least. G chicken and pea onions. Sure. You get out of here. Everyone gets a drink. Everyone gets a drink. Get out of here, bugs. Uh, moose. Cat crapple tiramisu. Uh, moose. Key lime. Moose. Crapple tiramisu. Shit. <laughs> moose cheesecake. I'm scared. I'm scared. Somebody save me. Somebody rescue me. This place is trying to take me alive. How do I escape? This is a cry for help. This is going to be a cry for help built into the actual receipt. And instead of a tip, I just want to drive home. Or to your home. I just need to escape this torment. Uh, uh, what, 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 I'm, I'm stuck? I'm stuck. Why am I stuck? No. Oh, sanitize. Shit. I, got, I didn't, I didn't notice the second row. Always forget to, never forget to sanitize. Uh, parmesan, croutons, broccoli, cucumbers, my brain. Oh my god. Oh, did I, did I get a sick point? I'm sorry. What did I do? How did I mess that one up? I don't want to get into people's sick points. That's, that's, that's horrible. Alright, we're gonna make fries, sweet potato, steak fries, uh, and then, right, I always forget to dunk. Fries, sweet potato, steak fries, french fries, dunk. Uh, <laughs> 
talking, saying things ever makes this whole thing harder. Okay. Thousand Island. Jeez. Ah, don't give me scary pop-ups. Did I do the right thing? I did the right thing. Broccoli. Shit. There was a second row. Uh, tiramisu, cream, key lime. Do, 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 Breading. Ah, I didn't mean to click on you, but let's do this now. Shit. No, no. Damn it. I didn't mean to click on that. You don't make any sense as a video game. Ah, season. You get out of here. You get the hell out of here. You don't belong here. I don't want you here. Uh, croutons. Moose key lime. Oh my god, I can't, man. I can't even... Why isn't a second person work here? Why is there not a second person who works here? Shit, I hit enter. I didn't want to hit enter, but I did. I'm so sorry. Uh... Is it over? No, it's... Uh, I, I can't even read that. I'm too busy. Shit, I hit enter too much. Wow, how fucked up was that? Uh, I did a bad thing somewhere. I don't even know what I did wrong. Something bad happened in a few places. And we're just gonna try to move past it as, as a society. Oh, come on. Ah, uh, Thousand Island. Cheese, croutons, mushrooms, broccoli. Ah, uh, get out of here. Uh, vinaigrette, like some kind of monster. What the fuck? Uh, bacon. I lost track of where I was completely for a second there. Croutons, tomatoes, uh, G chicken, pea onions, sure. Oh, fuck. Get in there! <laughs> Get out of here. Bye, peace. Peace at last. It's. Midnight. Oh my god, I never want to work in the service industry ever again. I've done it once. <laughs> I never want to go back. Hey, I won bad order. I remember that one. I remembered it all day. It was stuck in my brain. Causing me anguish. Alright, well this is Cook Serve Delicious too. It's neat. And, uh, goodbye. <laughs>